What's up guys, welcome to another video. This video, we're gonna be taking a look at the WD My Passport SSD one terabyte uh, size. This video is sponsored by Western Digital. Uh, this was provided to the show to review. Uh, this is an unbiased review and all expressions are my own and they have not been altered and reviewed and edited by any external entity. So, Let's go ahead and take a look at the Western Digital and the WD My Passport SSD. Okay, uh, one terabyte. This is available in 500 gig, one terabyte, and two terabytes. So we're in the middle with this one, with the one terabyte one. A uh, little bit on the box here: shock resistant. Um, it's drop rated up to 6.5 feet. No moving parts. Makes this a solid. Uh, state drive, thus the SSD. Password protection, backup, and a five year warranty. So, pretty good stuff. Uh, transfer speeds up to 1050 megabytes per second uh, with the reads, and I believe it's boasting about 10 or 1000 uh, megabytes per second writes. So, uh, definitely blistering speeds. This has got NVMe technology. Uh, which does allow you to have those uh, blazing speeds, right? Uh, it does come with the actual drive itself. This is the gray, almost looks silver, uh, but it is the gray model, super thin, super lightweight, uh, very, very nice design. Got to say, I like the uh, looks of it. Uh, also available in gold. So if you're like that, rocking that gold color, you got it, and red and blue. So you've got some color options. Um, again, this is the gray. What else comes in the box? You get the C2C cable and an adapter. This is uh, obviously for the legacy year ones, your 3.1s and uh, 3.0 type A USB. So this has the little port right here of USB-C. So let's go ahead. We're going to use the included cable. We're going to plug it in. And we're going to plug it into this MacBook Pro. And I do have a speed performance tester, the Blackmagic Disk Speed Test loaded up. I'm just plugging it in directly to the port. And let's go ahead. Now, you can use this as a backup for your time machine, your Apple time machine. You just have to format it appropriately to use it. do want to point that out. Uh, so let's go ahead and click on our disk speed. We're going to select the target drive and our target drive is going to be my passport. So we're going to select open and this is where we're going to see what kind of speed tests we get. So let's go ahead and zoom in so you can see this a little better. Move the camera up so you're not looking at the keyboard and look at those speeds. 924 megabytes. Right. Yes, per second. Reads, we got 890.2 megabytes per second. Those are blazing fast speeds in a portable SSD. Is that not? It's crazy. Now, we're not getting exactly the 1050 and the, the 1000 uh, megabytes per second boasted on the box, but, you know, we've got some, some factors to play in there. Uh, this is running Catalina. Uh, I did not upgrade to Big Sur. They do not list that they support Big Sur. Uh, so that's just a disclaimer. If you've upgraded to Big Sur, I don't think you're going to have any problems, but it's not on their list of supported OSs at the current time. So, um, also, did want to mention security. This guy has the AES 256 bit encryption. Uh, so, your data obviously is going to be secure. And that's a big thing. Keep your data secure. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Check the show notes uh, for a link not only to the product page, but to where you can purchase this and give it a look. Uh, as always, guys, thanks for watching. I did want to point out, too, one thing real quick. The discovery software that comes on board, you can install it and you can control uh, the drive. You can see it shows up right here, Passport, 100% uh, available. You can click on here. You can set the password. Uh, the UAS is on and you can eject it all through here. Uh, you can also click on the apps and it has like Western Digital or WD Drive Utilities and WD Security. So 
Uh, you do have some apps you can install in support of that. Um, so that is, in a nutshell, the WD, My Passport SSD. Guys, highly recommend. Take a look at it. Check the show notes. Give it a click and find out where to purchase. As always, guys, thanks for watching, and have a good one.